All right, guys, I'm going to give you a quick run through or a walk through of the new modifications that have happened to this fun Coca Cola boat here that I've made. So, you got some kind of you got all kinds of little mods that have been put in. So, first of all, this was not further down into the water enough, and uh. As you guys saw from some of the other tests, because of that, it would not turn the boat. And then, there was another problem, is because it was windy, because it didn't have one of these on the bottom here protruding, that was making it so easy for the boat to be pushed around. So I had to put one of those. So this has a servo on it, that one in the back has a servo on it. Um, also because I was having trouble with turning. So... That's an extra addition. So let me see if I can just power everything on here on the remote. Just turn that on. We always need to make sure that this is all the way down and this is all the way up for this mod. And make the good old batteries. Dump them in there. Put the battery in its little compartment there. And now I will zoom out a little bit manually here so hopefully you guys can see the whole ship and what it can do so first thing we're gonna do as we always do is arm well first we're gonna um, bind it then arm that front rotor go into this mode here and then I'm gonna lift it up so you guys can see how that also works over there See, we've got this one moving the same time as the back one. Hard to see, but that's going to give us better steering than what we originally had. And so, let me just turn everything off. And how to turn it off is it will just automatically turn off, or you can do this and then press that to turn it off. Anyway, there we go. That's a quick walk through of how that's all going to work out and then on a day when it's not windy I'll go and uh, sail it for you guys and then I plan on mounting my Lenovo camera up here so that you get a 180 vision um, otherwise we put a different camera on here you can see 360 however 360 is going to give you some of that and the rotor blade on top spinning so that might I don't know make people uneasy so I don't know if that's a good idea but the 180 should film everything in the front here you know right left everything so that should be pretty fun in of itself so and also since I was there at the lake today I was um, I met the patrol and the nice lady from the patrol told me that it's okay to sail this obviously not on a windy day because it just won't have the power and uh, just to make sure that the rules are uh, to, to be mindful of the wildlife and therefore that's what we're gonna do anyway thanks for watching guys hope you guys enjoyed this video um, stay safe be good with your RC vehicles um, follow the rules especially in Irvine California and Woodbridge because once somebody does something ridiculously bad then we all suffer and so be mindful and kind to everybody anyway oh the last thing that i was about to leave without saying is i have one of these things here so i can attach it on there just in case the thing even on a not so windy day if i lose control of it i can always reel it back in with one of these so that's the last bit that i forgot to mention anyway thanks for watching guys See you soon.